Okay, it is, ladies and gents, back for another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. The amazing game is now out fully, even if you didn't buy the Deluxe Edition. So feel free to share in the chat, you know, if you have any questions before buying it, if you're not sure, I'll be happy to do my best to answer. Today we're going to continue, you know, playing. We're going to continue playing. In particular, I want to advance a bit the story. We're going to have... Um, you know, the next Sebastian story and hopefully maybe close, get us close to learn the dark arts. Let's go. And of course, if you have any question on what we've done so far, you know, recently. Oh, maybe let me just take this before we forget. Because recently we learned Alomora all levels. We've been, unlock, been able to unlock a lot of doors that were previously blocked. We've also... Got enough first vivarium. There are four vivarium, so we only got one out of four. We got some beasts, including unicorn. Pretty cool. Revelio. What is there? Wait, there's nothing here? That seems strange. How can there be nothing inside? Or maybe it will be later in the quest. That does seem very strange, but anyway, let's go up to talk to Sebastian. You made it. Yeah, we slept on the floor the whole night. Very cool. <laughs> Enjoying the view? Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar oh, interest in that castle. Rockwood Castle. Rockwood castle. That makes sense. Solomon is a former aura and refuses to look into it, even after Anne was cursed by one of them, possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. Are goblins forbidden from carrying wands? Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us, which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anne I used to know. And if there's anything you want me to show in the episode, of course, feel free to share in the chat. This way. Let's follow him. Revelio. Feldcroft used to be a lot livelier. With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time. Everyone stays out of sight. Okay, Here cute little village. Almost feels like inside. hobbits. <laughs> Let's enter his home and meet his sister. Aha. Sebastian, where did you? Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. Nothing There's can. That's a bit depressing. That reality, the but we haven't tried everything. There is no cure. When will you accept that? Never. I can never accept. Oh, that. she doesn't feel good. <laughs> now look what you've done. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, well, that was depressing. See that. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. Okay. Oh, Sebastian, not the visit he'd hoped for. Let's change how we look. I don't like those glasses at all. And let's also change actually the robe. I just got a Merlin's robe from Twitch. Where is it? Too many. Merlin. Look at this. Looks pretty cool. I like it. Okay. Let's go. Talk to. Oh, he's actually outside. That boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes. Sebastian's friend. 
I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. He thinks he can help Anne, oh, but nothing can be done for her. That's real sad. Not yet discovered the cure. Ah, you, you sound like Sebastian, thinking you know better than the healers at St. Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne, and the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the loyalists' way. Mm. I understand what you're saying, sir. Good. I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. <laughs> but what should no he do? Idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. I hope you remember what I've said. Good day. Hmm, that's a bit ominous. Revelio. I'm sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. What's that? Another letter? Are you alright, Anne? I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. And I'm alright. The pain from this curse comes in bouts, and often suddenly. So sad. It's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met my first day at Hogwarts, in the Slytherin common room. Oh, the common room. Oh, I adored teasing first years about spotting mermaids through the window. <sighs> I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being at Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cosy retreat it once Shame. was. Shame. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an exora. But refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. I'm going to fix it, don't worry. Well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. That would be so Sebastian sad. I cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. No. I'm gonna oh, take away your pain, your myself. Him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. Oh, she's so sad. I wish you well. I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. Why will he not listen to me? She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance at what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. <laughs> yeah. I know he's angry, but he's only trying to do what he thinks is best for Anne. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. Shame. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son, as if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. Okay. But I'm ready to kick their ass if you want. All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. I probably should go take a look. That's probably a Merlin trial. Up there, on that plateau, is where they cursed Anne. This way. I'm here. You can run. How much longer are we expected to 
Oh, wait. So I need this and I want this one. And this is fine. And here we're going to do this one. And wait. This one. Okay. Oh. oh no, that's a loyalist. I need to do it on a commander, but there's no commander here. So I need to find a commander, I guess. <laughs> Is there a commander here? No, I still don't see a commander. Oh, behind me. No. A leaping wild loyalist commander. No, we don't have that. Rebellion. Oh, one more. Maybe it's that one there. No, oh, that's a sentinel. Oopsie, <laughs> that hurts. Where is he? Oh, man. Yeah. Where well, there's a bug? But this does. In your face. Oh, that's the commander. Here he is. So we need to slam him into the ground. Let's finish everybody else first.
Oh no, that's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> we missed this uh, dueling feat. A lot of potions that we don't really need. Some repower there. Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. It may be grasping at billywigs, but I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The Loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? Revelia. They seem to have set up camp here for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. I've heard the goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the Ministry isn't doing more. Ha. Whose home was this? It's been abandoned long since I've lived here. Rumor was a Hogwarts professor lived here once, centuries ago. Yeah, it's one of Merlin's friends. Rebellion. Clear. This is Morgana. I've seen this before. The house, the well, the view. Morgana's house. Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. Revelio. Sebastian, over here. Do you think this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be. But it looks to me as though this was intentional. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you- I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganock. She was one of the keepers. The keepers? Like in Quidditch? And you found a pensive in the library? I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. 
And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves Keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It all has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by Keepers. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch Keepers hundreds of years ago. See, you know it all. I know you. I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it? When you put it like that. The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the Keepers. Look at this. Revelio. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? Only one way to find out. Revelio. Let's go down. Why bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something here worth a closer look. They've left all of this simply strewn about. Tells me they're after something bigger. Morgana. Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. A journal entry of Isadora's. I should hold on to this. Rebellion. What did we miss? What am I missing? There. You're not going to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. Lumos. What a, oh no, we need to speak with him. Sorry, I missed that. I know it sounds strange. Honestly, but... nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall, as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient. Magic. Oh yes. But you said you didn't really understand it, and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. And I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows, I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be flawed. We can, but perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even Ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway, here we come. I'm tempted to hold my breath. Let's go. Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. Oh no. It's gone. It's a map, no? Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A note. Let's have a look. So ancient magic. I can't really see much more than that. If you see anything, don't hesitate to say in the chat or in the comments. Anything helpful in the notes? Not really. A rune 
symbol. <coughs> I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry. I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not. Is it connected to our common room? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. Mm -hmm. I have no idea our visit to see Anne would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. Yeah, we're friends. I'll Rebellion. be in touch. Till then. So what new quests are we gonna go through now? Okay, that's ominous. Let's see our quest log and our gear. How much do we have actually? Yeah, we have some space. All good. Last 10 astronomy. Okay. I'm still missing one of those. The Dalian keys. So we can open the che the feathering chest, which is level 30, and uh, this was a map, I didn't really look at it yet. Let's maybe do quickly the astronomy before we get, you know, to our button, because we are already in the castle. So astronomy... Oh, there is a page not too far. I heard the ting. Who knows where? Oh, there's a trunk there. Let's open it. see it maybe it's not in that room let's go to class and then we can find it after
Or maybe it's only there at night. No, I don't see anything. So let's do the class. That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Ladies, Professor Shah. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that doesn't mind, seem interesting. Take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. Okay. Still don't have your own? You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar. Here, I can adjust that for no, you. No, no, bring it into focus on your own. Okay, okay. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? Yeesh. Professor, I don't like this class. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the Aren't you Look <laughs> a magician? The the Highlands, you can just make an incendio. On the very self same stars above us. Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. Nobody cares. <laughs> Hello. I don't believe we've met officially. I'm Amit. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Hello, Amit. It's nice to meet you. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, okay. I, thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some, uh,. Reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Sure. Revelio. I tried to put off my stargazing as long as I could. Ah, oh, here it is. Oh, me thinks he knows everything. Told me he can speak gobbledygook. Sounded like gibberish to me. And found this is old telescope. Looks practically brand new. He took get good care of it. A pristine night for stargazing. The perfect night for I have the telescope. It's nicer than I had expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> but there is, um, something else. Yes. What is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. Okay. And you need someone to help you find it. I do. Are you in? 
No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. Oh, no need to convince me. Let's get going. Brilliant. You won't regret it. Shall we? Where are we going? <coughs> the table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform, something that doesn't quite belong. We'll know it when we see it. Onwards we go. Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. Huh. It is nice having a fellow. And I see something there. Happy to be here. It is good to leave the classroom now and then. And there is also a page somewhere. Right, is it? The gobstone. Here I am, charging ahead. Why don't you lead the way? If you're sure. Here it is. Cage bastard. <laughs> Interesting. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Amit, could I ask you something? Oh, um, certainly. Why are you so fascinated with stars? I suppose because there is so much to learn about them. I mean, there is plenty to learn about a lot of subjects, but astronomy seems limitless. Always something new being discovered. Okay. They are forever discovering new moons and stars. In fact, they discovered a new planet just 50 years ago. Actually, that's all I wanted to know. Oh, very well then. <laughs> Don't seem disappointed. Revelia. So what do we do with that? Do we break them? Revelia. Cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? <laughs> oh, no. Not this close to the school, Emmett. I think you should do the honors. Go on, try it out. The constellation should appear near the center of your view. Okay, so rotate, zoom in, zoom as out. As you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. I mean, I don't see many. Oh, we need to zoom in. Okay, get it now. Sorry about that. Took me a minute. Okay, so we need to zoom in. I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoir. Oh, I'm a star. Thank you, Emmett. I look forward to reading them. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> <laughs> this is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forests. Cool. All beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. I remember I seeing one a few episodes ago and oh, didn't know what to do with it. Telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Thank you. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook. Oh, okay, sure. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Um, anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. I will see you soon. So, if we check on the map, we can see that in Hogwarts, there is one more astronomy table or it's a zero out of one maybe it's because it's not found yet but if we look you know there's over here there's a oh, over here yeah there's one astronomy table for example here there's 14 in total basically 
to make it simple. Okay. And that's a new challenge, which will give us something. What will it give us? Some appearances. Okay. <coughs> oh, Sebastian. This new quest. Let's make sure we do it while we're in the castle. No, sorry. But do not hesitate to also tell me in the chat if there's anything specific you want to see. Always keen to hear and do my best also to show you any question that you may have about the game. I'm always on adventures. Anything to do with the dark art should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the risk. I agree. I agree. And I'll not say a word more. I'm sorry. Shame. I won't give up. I'll help you, my friend. He's being ridiculous. Apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. Omina swears it was used for the dark arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. I'll help you, my friend. The dark arts do pique my interest. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Perhaps I've spoken out of turn. Ominous's family history is personal to him. That's true. Okay. I'd like to know more about it, if you wouldn't mind telling me. I won't repeat it. Very well. But do keep this between us. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Are you familiar with the Cruciatus curse? It hurts. Crucio, correct? The Cruciatus curse, also known as the torture curse, inflicts excruciating pain on the victim. Apparently. His parents and older siblings had no qualms about casting us on muggles for sport. Ominous described the sound of the victim's cries as horrific. So the first time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. As punishment, his family cast it on him. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to. But he still has shame himself. He was probably so... Young too. How horrible. Poor Ominous, he was only a child. He shouldn't blame himself. After that incident, the rift between Ominous and his family only grew. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind him of that when I follow up about the scriptorium. Watch for my owl. I'll have news soon enough. Oh, I thought we were going now. I'm a bit disappointed. He'll change his mind. Revelio. Nothing left over here. We have looked uh, quite a bit across. Oh, there is one page not too far. I can hear a uh, ting, but it's quite far away. It seems closer over here. Revelio. Seems even closer here. But who knows where it is. Oh, 
Okay, so we have the Hogwarts emblem there, crest with the four houses. And do not wake up a dragon that's sleeping. And now we should probably go do the next quest. Unless you want me to do anything specific, just share in the comments. The high keep. How far is that? He is on the world map for sure, and it's quite far. Good thing we have discovered all of the blue flames. It's easy to just go there. How nice to see you, my young friend. Pavelio. Oh, there's some thing to steal over here. Oh, and an inferi. Oh, he wasn't out yet. There's also some at the bottom there, by the way. Let's get them before we forget. What is that? Oh, a great spine. And a dueling feat at the same time. That's great. Another one there. Oh, and there's something hiding in the back. That's probably from the Merlin trial. Let's just continue the quest for now. You can always come back for that. Just over here, quietly. I am glad that you received my owl. We need to stay low and remain quiet. Daddy, what's going on? Why are we all the way out here? As promised, I did some investigating to find out what Harlow was up to. I followed him to the Hogshead. I noticed him reading a letter. All I could see was that it was signed by and bore the seal of Victor Rookwood. And after you told me that Rookwood and Harlow were after you, I decided that you were the perfect person to join me in taking them down. For good. That letter is the tangible proof that Officer Singer needs. It is why I followed Harlow here, and why I wrote to you. I need your help to retrieve it. You seem to be very determined in stopping Rookwood and Harlow. Why? I knew men like him in Uganda. I know how bad things can get if they are not stopped. It's a long story. One I promise to share when we have more time. For now, let's do what we came <coughs> to do. Okay. I don't trust the ministry, I'm so let's do it together. First, we must access the castle keep. I'll check the main gate, see if you can find another way in. That sounds I like the it. first trailer. Try to be as quiet as possible. Hollow is here after all. Pavelio. So do we enter? Over there. Pavilion. Okay, we are inside. Hmm. I wonder what that does. That did it. And then we probably need to take 
Peace out. And oops, <laughs> that was a failure. Sorry about that. Let's jump again. Oh, is it stuck now? Damn. I need to be cheese. Okay. Over here. Oh, it's not high enough. The second one. What am I missing? Hmm. Okay, wait. Let me take a second. So, this is definitely where we need to go. But putting one of these wasn't enough, it seems. Is there a second? No, probably not. I mean, she's stuck there, so she's useless. I feel like this is here. Just put it maybe not exactly how it should be. Hmm. Anybody watching knows, don't hesitate also to tell me in the chat. over here just in case missing something no Rebellion. where could it be because down there's nothing right just check over here yeah she's just useless no one enters this gate instantly What if I try to attack this one? So this one is clearly over here, that's easy. But then, yeah, I don't know where to go. Let's try even more, just in case. Oh, this one has been done. I go there? No, there's nothing there. Ah, oh. strange, strange, strange. It's probably super obvious once you found it. And I felt this was really the place. But somehow it's not working. Because this will get us there and then this will get us up. Okay, I'm a bit at lost here. <laughs> That's probably not a good idea. Oh, it came back. It was such a bad idea that it came back now.
Hmm. And what if I close that now? No. Clearly not. Huh. That's an interesting one. Guardian Leviosa.
Lumos. Okay, finally. Basically, you need to turn it on the side. That's what was missing. Okay, that was the first time one of those puzzle stuff really kept me for a few minutes. Let's just check if there's not some resources to steal. Okay, we are inside. Wait, what? Okay, should be out now. Let's go inside. That looks as if it might raise the gate. Don't oh. <laughs> oh, it's going back. So our friend should have been able to enter now. What is that? Mm, I don't think it worked. Let's try again. And then Axio. No, on this one. Okay, now it's worked. Cool. I knew you could do it. This way. I will get the door. Okay. We are in. Oh, what did I do? Sorry about that. That is the main keep. My guess is that we'll find Halo and the letter inside. Yeah, this is definitely from the trailer. Hi, disillusion yourself. Hippogriff. Oh, this poor hippogriff. Yeah, we do, we do. Let's save him. New plan. I get the evidence and you free that hippogriff. Agreed? This is our chance. Go. Oh, blast it. Oh, there's got to be a, another way 
to get up to the roof. Somewhere. Just because I'm a poacher doesn't mean I dislike things. Pavelio. I hope Natty stays out of trouble. Okay. Thank you everybody for watching. Don't hesitate to share also in the comments or in the chat if there's anything specific you want to see. Otherwise, I'm just going on with the story right now. What is that there? Oh, we missed this one there. Sorry. No, let's go back. Oh, there's one in the top there, too. Um. I don't know where it needs to go. <laughs> Maybe let's push it so we can enter. Can we enter? Mm. We need to get to the roof. What am I missing? Ah, oh, over here. This is now here. No, not there. Let's take it with us. Probably needs to go somewhere. I turn it around. Turn, turn. This is finicky sometime. <laughs> or maybe I'm just doing it wrong, I don't know. Let's try like this. Who knows? No. Safest place to sneak into. Revelio. Ascender. Wingardium Leviosa. My dream of making a better world for me. Come on, turn. Oh, I sent it back. Sorry about that. It's not there, right? Let me just check. No, it's not there. It's clearly over here. We just need to once again put it nicely. No. Ah. Okay, this dungeon is officially my least favorite one. <laughs> I don't know. Cause I'm guessing this is not working, right? Turn. How do you turn? <laughs> Big failure. Yes, finally. It's Petripicus Totalus.
Let's continue. Oh, a few. But if we do... That... Oh! Enjoy this. Did she see us or not? I don't think so. But I think if we get too close, she will look. See, she's definitely okay. We need to fight. So let's go. Whoopsie. No. Okay, moving on over here. Don't know where my friend went. Okay, we're making progress in this dungeon, but I keep getting lost for some reason. I hope Natty's having an easier time of it. Indeed. Let's make sure we take all of the resources because we're never gonna come back here. Hello, Mora. If you don't know how to do it. Don't hesitate to uh, tell me in the chat and I'll explain. Rebellion. Quite a bit of money. That's great. <coughs> Nothing there. Let's go up. Oh. You're going home in a wooden box. No, no, you are. See? <laughs> In your face. Okay, that was easy. Let's open this one. Okay. Yes. Let's steal everything. Incendio. Oops. That is completely the wrong <laughs> the wrong one. I'm sorry. And the last one. They can't really go anywhere, so they don't have a choice. I don't think I had a leaf floor before. First one. Great. Okay. That is all. Definitely not being very uh, 
stealth. Who leaves, leaves money or lying around like this? Liar cheating us. More moss on the roof. Think. Yeah. My wing is all right. Oh, there's two of them. Nice. Who sends a Vadekedara to beast like this? And we are flying. It's like a broom. Probably doesn't do it justice, right? Like, if you were actually on an hippogriff. Let's get closer. Can we land on it? Scream, Emma. I wonder if anyone can see us from the castle. Well, it's a bit dark. They're supposed to sleep right now. under control. Were you able to find the letter? Summoned it straight out of Harlow's hands. <laughs> I will say, I did not expect to see him cast the killing curse at us. He won't forget this. Be on your guard. Of course. What did the letter say? That Rookwood's looking for a phoenix. Oh, a phoenix. Sure where he will find one. But it also included Harlow's orders to inspect that castle for the poachers. Enough to connect Harlow to the crimes. I shall deliver the letter to Officer Singer. She'll have to do something when she sees it. Nice. Now, tell me, where did you meet these hippogriffs? I've only met Highwing before. Poppy introduced us. Poppy Sweeting knows a hippogriff. <laughs> of course she does. Poppy will be relieved to know that Highwing's safe. I came to the right person for help. My mother will be worried. I must go. Seek me out soon. I shall have much to tell you. 
much. Graphics are not perfect on those hippogriffs for some reason. Yeah, that definitely wasn't my favorite dungeon, let's say. So we can walk and we can fly. Ooh. I have learned of a wizard who is being harassed by Halo. He may be able to provide the evidence we need to take Halo down. We should speak with him together. Meet me at his home. High wing, go! He stopped by the room of requirement. Deke tells me he has something to share with you. Okay. So it is with L1, right? You can see with the L1, I have now my hippogriff. Now the question is... Sorry. There's a map chamber to discuss that and our next steps. Oh, so many new quests. But yeah, I just wanted to see I have it here. Why is it still locked? Maybe we need to wait just one more minute. Oh no, maybe because I'm on it. Sorry. Rebellion. So if we now open our gear. We can change our flying mount. Right, we have the this hippogriff, that hippogriff, and this death roll that we got because of the deluxe edition. Probably need to go sell things before we do the next quest. But we have yeah the map chamber. Lost child and Deek. Deek will probably help us to unlock, you know, a new vivarium, so that would be great. And this one, as it says, the second keeper trial. Anything else you want to see, don't hesitate also to tell me in the chat. If you want to see fight. Whatever it is that you want to see. Oh, talk to the goblins. There's a new quest there. Maybe we can go sell first and then talk to that goblin. I'm still missing a couple of pages in Hogsmeade. Let's just check. I'm missing two collection chests, seven field guides, and zero statues. We have all of the statues. Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. What can I do for you today? I want to sell things to you. We have crossed the 15,000 money. Okay. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. And where was this goblin? Rebellion. Map over here. Oh, it's hiding the bottom. Hello, is something the matter? Most decidedly, yes. My precious moon calf biscuit was abducted by poachers up north. Oh no. Vicious brutes. I tried to fight back, but I was no match for them. I'm sorry about your moon calf, Mr. Garnath. Just Garnath. I'm only one goblin. Not a particularly brave one at that. I have no chance. I'll help you. Bloodthirsty poachers. Oh, my poor biscuit. I can only hope she's able to escape. 
Why do you suppose the poachers took Biscuit? I have no idea. Mooncalf dung's highly valuable for fertilizing magical plants. I cannot imagine poachers care much about gardening. Who knows what Hello, Arunav. Thanks for watching. Gutted and stuffed. I assume. Oh, Biscuit. Don't hesitate to tell me if you want to see anything specific, fight, brooms, any question. I am in Slithering. She followed me one evening, but wouldn't leave my side. Never thought I was one for a pet of any kind. Now I can't imagine life without her. Moon calves are often thought of as silly, simple minded creatures. But I've seen great depth of character in Biscuit. I wouldn't trade her for a hippogriff or a hippopotamus, or even a goose that lays golden eggs. <laughs> okay, I'll keep an eye out. I'll find it. How kind. If only all of Wizard Kind was as gracious to goblins. If you do see her and can bring her safely home to me, I promise to reward you for your efforts. <laughs> do keep an eye out for her, and be careful out there. Slithering is the house that the uh, Wizarding World quiz gave me. So that's the one I went to for this first one. Remember, you can also change over here your appearance. Where is my Slithering house fanatic robe? Here it is. But I do like this new Merlin one. Things pretty cool. And to be honest, all of the houses are pretty good they don't really impact most of the gameplay there is a few small quests that are different depending on your house but it, it really it's not that important you know so just choose the one you like the most uh, maybe the visual i have a video on my channel showing the visual of each house and maybe that's what you want to choose based and indeed you don't have to follow you know the wizarding world quiz you can just ask the sorting heart basically to put you wherever you want oh there is halloween look this wasn't there before that's cool let's just check yeah we've changed season so now we have all of those pumpkins but before they weren't there that's very cool Why can't I go on my broom anymore? Because I'm inside Augsmeet or what? <coughs> Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Yeah, that's true. We're always having good fun in Hogsmeade. Remember, we're still missing seven pages, so that's why I'm also taking a quick look around. See if I get a ting sound of these pages, these field pages. Nothing inside here. No, not hearing anything. Oh, what shares? I'm sure it'll be. Thought we'd forget it. Is this? It isn't Nora Treadwell's guardian. All right, have you? They have no chance to get me. Done. So the broom, you need to follow the um, storyline, and at some point you will go to class. I've seen better days. It is before. There's a chest there. It's before the first trial of Merlin, but it's definitely you know I think you should be around level ten at least type of thing, and then you get your first broom. And then you can fly around anywhere you want. What is that beast over there? Let's see. Maybe expand our vivarium a bit. 
Oh, frogs. Yeah, they are important. So, let's see. Oh, why are they not coming to me? Uh, let's uh, do, do, do like this. Put Accio. Where is it? Flipendo. Flipendo and Accio. No, sorry. And Accio. Oh, he's running away. And one frog. Yes. First one. What is that? I don't remember seeing that before. Oh, it's a limberant. Okay, let's go. I see a page and a Yes, we got it. A legendary chest. Cool. That was the first one we saw. Let's take maybe one more frog and then be on our way. Done. Okay, back on our broom. Feel free to say Aruna if I didn't answer your question properly. If you have any other question, I'd love to be able to help. I wouldn't say I know everything, but I'm trying my best. What is that? This is good. These ones are easy. You just need to land on it. And done. But yeah, there's the poacher at the below. Let's go down. Let's hide. Quite a few. Just looking around before attacking. He's weak. Yes, he is. When's the last time you saw him catch a beast? Spends more time petting the thing. Okay, one down. Oh, there's a chest over here. Venom, okay. Oh, there's many there. Let's see, can I get this one? Probably gonna need to fight a couple of these. But let's see if I can get one more. Oh, two there. Goblin 
Easy. Let's unlock all of this. A little more. Hello, Mora. Super important spell to learn. Otherwise, you can't open any of those locked gates. Should I take them all? <laughs> oh, they are. All right, biscuit. Let's get you back to going up, shall we? Well, let's take a couple more. Maybe one or two. Can always sell them if Everything's all right now. needed. It's better than to just leave them with the butchers. Okay. Oh, there's a beast over there. Go kill it. What's happening? Oh, it's dead already. Oh, a small... What is that? Is that even a magical beast or just a normal beast? That doesn't seem to be an... Magical beast. I think it's just a normal one. Moonstone, always important for your ring of requirement. And speaking of which, maybe we can do another D quest soon. If I look at my map. Oh, and Sebastian, we can learn Crucio in this next quest. That's going to be a good one. Where is it? Oh, over here. Dick. So yeah, I think that's going to be cool. But we'll do that just after I get a bit of food. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Don't hesitate to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. So you know when I'll be streaming again later today. And if you have any questions, anything you want to see in the next few episodes or any questions, you know, like guides that are needed, I also have a few on the channel. So don't hesitate to check and also to share in the comments if there's anything I haven't done yet. You know, knowing that it is interesting for you would be great for me to know. Okay, thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time.